everyone, how are you doing today? This is Steven with Divine Mobile Home Central. In today's 360 virtual walkthrough tour video, we are going to be touring this beautiful Destiny home model, which would be the Timberland Elite slash TE16542A. This is a two bedroom, two bathroom single wide, and it's 837 square feet, so, and a 16 by 54. So, with that being said, let's get started with the walkthrough tour so of course right here uh, this will be your front door area and as well as your beautiful living room and of course it looks right into the kitchen and dining room area we'll get you all a view from another angle Plenty of space in this living room. I really love the um, drapes that they would have in the uh, living room area as well. Another uh, view of the living room from another angle. Again, you got plenty of space for a um, sectional. You can put like a TV right there or, you know, whatever you want to do. And of course, right here be your dining room space. You got plenty of space for a uh, dining area. So this will be your dining room slash kitchen combination. So again, you have um, space for a four seater or a two seater or, you know, if you don't want anything, just leave it blank. And of course, you have plenty of right space right here for a uh, table or you can also put a center island you know you can always buy an aftermarket uh, center island you know from Amazon Ikea or even Lowe's or Home Depot and now uh, you can really customize it and make it your very own at least that's what I would do let me know down in the comment section what you would do with the um, this space in the uh, middle of the kitchen I would definitely love to hear it So it's another good look at your beautiful kitchen. So we are gonna take a much closer look. As you notice, you would have your um, stainless steel appliances. You would have white cabinetry. You would have your sink right here. Uh, you would have a window above the kitchen sink, which is an absolute plus. I absolutely love that. Nothing like being able to look out the window while you're doing the dishes. Uh, you have your uh, Formica countertop right there. It's a nice, um, you know, it's like a nice marble-like tan color. I really like it. And you also would have the backsplash too. And of course you have your um, plug-in outlets along the uh, wall underneath the cabinets for um, small kitchen appliances. Of course you have your stove area right there, which um, you would have your um, microwave up above also. Of course, you got plenty of drawer space by the stove area too. So, this definitely looks into the uh, living room and the dining room area. So, if you're looking for like an open concept, this would definitely be the um, space for you. And of course, you would have your recessed lighting in the kitchen as well. Overall, this is a very nice um, area. Very nice area. All right, so let's go and check out the bedrooms. So this would be your long hallway. As you notice, you have recessed lighting in your hallway. All right, so let's check out this uh, guest bedroom right here. This would be the only guest bedroom. All right, get you all a view from another angle. Again, if you're a single person, this would be perfect for like an office or, you know, or a study or, or a sewing room or you know or even a TV room it's whatever you want to use it for or if you have one or two children this would also be perfect have your closet space right there not the largest closet I've ever seen but it's very adequate I'll get y'all a view from another angle for this uh, bedroom A 
I love all the natural light that's coming into this room. All right, so here is your hallway again. I like the fact that they have a window in the uh, hallway for the uh, for this uh, single wide home. Right there you have a, a linen storage or even a, um, a toiletry storage right there. That's a nice feature. Nothing like extra storage for um, whatever you need to um, store. And of course right there you have a space right there that will be your central heat and air furnace. All your heating and air conditioning run right through there. That's, that's on the side of the uh, guest bathroom. Alright so this is your hallway guest bathroom. Got plenty of space in this bathroom. Let's take a closer look. So right here you would have your um, your sink and your vanity, as well as your mirror and your vanity lighting. Again, you have your Formica countertop and as well as your porcelain sink. And of course you have you'll have space underneath the cabinet too. And right there, you would have a toilet paper holder. That's a nice feature. You don't see that too often in manufactured homes, so that's a nice feature to have. It comes standard with a uh, bathroom tissue holder. And of course, you would have your commode. All right, let's take a look over here at the beautiful garden tub. Sh uh, <laughs> not garden tub, it's a standard, um, tub and shower combo excuse me so you have your um beautiful standard shove tub and shower combo you no know, like i always say it's this i love these because they're very easy to maintain and keep clean and of course up there above that you would have an optional transom window so it's nothing like natural light in your bathroom in the daytime And of course, right here, you would have a, t a towel rack. You know, it's always a tongue twister for me when I say that. It's a towel rack. So, you know, you don't see that very often either in manufactured homes either. So, this is mostly like a standard feature for like site built homes. So, that's very nice that they, um, that they considered putting that in there, the manufacturer. Overall, this is a very nice guest bathroom. And then right there, straight ahead, you would have your electric box will be which would be behind that cabinet so I thought that was very clever too so it's a perfect way to disguise your um, electric box all right so let's take a look over here uh, this would be the area for your washer and dryer so you got your washer and dryer hookup you will have also would ha have a water shutoff valve which would be above the uh, washer connections so, you know, most manufactured homes, they'll have the water shutoff valve underneath the house, but they put it, they put this right inside the house. So if you're going away for the weekend or the winter or whatever, you can turn off your water for the house. So you don't have to worry about the pipes bursting or, or anything like that, or any issues of that, of that nature. And of course you would have your um, AC air, air conditioning vents in the ceiling throughout the entire home. You know, some homes come with vents in the floors, but you can also get the vents in the ceilings as well. All right, so before we check out the master bedroom, uh, if you're new here, I invite you to hit that subscribe button. Um, I do manufactured modular home tours, and I also do virtual 360 walkthrough tours like this one that you are seeing today. And I also do general manufactured home information videos. So if any of that interests you, definitely consider subscribing and joining our family. Welcome, we are very happy to have you here. All right, so here is the master bedroom. So this is your master, you guys. You have plenty of space in your master bedroom. You definitely would have space for a king size bed or a queen size bed. You could definitely put um, two nightstands on either side of the bed. It's whatever you want to do. I'll probably put like a, um, a tall te chester drawer right there, directly in front of us. And I'll probably put like a, um, a regular drawer, probably over there where the, um, 
where the window is. But you know, at least that's what I would do, but it's really up to you as what you would do with the space. Let me know down in the comment section what you would do with the master bedroom space. I would definitely love to hear it. Another thing I want to point out, I love the fact that they have those uh, white um, uh, chair rails along the wall. That's nice. So this may be a side drywall home, but this is that's a very nice feature though. I just noticed that. So I figured I'd point that out to you. Okay, so this is your master closet. So uh, the master closet would have your uh, water heater access. So your water heater right be, be right behind the access panel right here in the closet where which would have the orange sticker on it and of course you got uh, plenty of um, you know storage space for hanging clothes and uh, shoes or purses or hats or whatever you have whatever works for you so another good look at this master bed right here and i really love the uh wood vinyl flooring that they would have throughout this house no carpet in this house you guys absolutely no carpet all right so this is your master bathroom you guys so you have very nice adequate space in this master bathroom of course right there straight ahead you would have your uh, towel rack again you would have your commode you would have your uh, sink right there with the formica countertop as well as the backsplash and the porcelain sink and of course you would have the toilet paper or bathroom tissue holder on the side of the sink right there very nice feature so of course right here this would be your uh, shower area you got plenty of space in the shower um, you definitely have two benches right here in the shower. You have your shower head. Again, you have two benches. You would have your, um, your um, turn on and shut off valve. And of course, you would have your another optional transom window above the master bathroom shower. All right, so this right here is looking into the uh, master bathroom again. So overall, this is a very nice manufactured home. Very impressive. This is a Destiny Home Timber Elite model. So, and of course, the, uh, the description of this model will be down in the description box. So, I hope you've all enjoyed this tour today. Um, this will conclude the tour of this virtual walkthrough tour. This is Stephen with Divine Mobile Home Central. You all have a wonderful day.